Call him an old-fashioned Grinch. A man on the northwest side spent his Christmas Eve ransacking his neighbors' homes. But thanks to a bit of luck and quick work by Pima County deputies, Christmas was not a bust. Marcelino Benito explains in tonight's Nine in Your Side Crime Watch. A Christmas crook tonight <laughs> behind bars. It was like you no good, worthless, lazy bums. <laughs> And this is one of the people he ripped off Christmas Eve. Leona Lovis came home Monday night to this shattered window. And I said, what? You've got to be kidding. But this was no joke. Michael Francis, one of her neighbors, broke in and snatched everything right from under her tree. So, yeah, I was angry. I was very angry. She was the second victim in just a matter of hours in this neighborhood. How would you describe that suspect's behavior? Well, I would call it relentless, that's for sure. Uh, disrespectful, to say the least. Deputies took Francis in last night, but this afternoon, they were in search of evidence at a nearby home. Nine on your side, cameras there as detectives comb through a trailer looking for more stolen property, gifts, belongings that Lovis wants back. They were all wrapped, and um, I know there was a lot of money there. <laughs> Some of her things have already been returned, and that's thanks to deputies and the other victim in this Christmas crime who just happened to see the crook as he was driving home. I would call that very lucky. Uh, I mean, we have these incidents where the luck is on the side of the victim, and fortunately that was the case in this uh, particular investigation. A crucial tip that led deputies down this street helped recover Christmas gifts and got this naughty nuisance off the block. I'm going to stay here. If they come back, I'm going to pop somebody. <laughs> No need to pop anyone tonight. Michael Francis sits in Pima County Jail. He's facing first-degree burglary charges. And Guy, deputies say this investigation is ongoing. Is it possible that anybody else was involved in these crimes? Guy, I can tell you Francis's mother was also arrested last night on a misdemeanor warrant. What connection she may have to these burglaries is still unclear. All in the family. Thank you.